pets. They're very cute. I really can't recommend that store highly enough. A couple more visits and you'll find that the fur on your tail is silky smooth. A gorgeous tail like yours deserves lots of tender loving care. <laughs> Don't you agree? Uh, it, no need. I'm not <coughs> interested in that kind of thing. You say that, but do I see your ears saying otherwise? Although your tail isn't professionally maintained, the fur doesn't look dry and coarse. To me, this says you like to take care of it. I'm also guessing that you like to curl up into a fetal position and hug your fluffy tail tight as you go off to sleep. How do you know? <clears throat> Don't be ridiculous. I'm a high-ranking general of Watatsumi Island. How could I do such a thing? Oh, it's okay. There's no need to be embarrassed. The desire to cuddle up to a soft tail while sleeping is quite natural. Really? W wait, no. Why are we still on this topic? In fact, why am I even here talking about tails with you in the first place? Why? Because you are blessed with a wonderful fluffy tail, that's why. I think it's very cute. Ugh, I'm trapped. How do I get out of this? It's you! Oh, thank goodness. Please save me. Oh, and how is my favorite little one doing, hmm? I didn't expect to meet you here. We were just talking about tails. Goro has a beautiful tail, don't you think? Doesn't it make you want to stroke it? Hey, not you too. <laughs> Goro, now do you understand how appealing your tail is? Uh, pardon me. Lady Gucci, we have completed the matter you instructed us about previously. We have selected a very skilled artist to be in charge. I'm confident that the finished product will be to your satisfaction. I'll take a look later, and if everything's in order, place it in front of the store. All right, I won't tease the two of you any further. Do make the most of your trip here, won't you? Quite a lot has changed. <laughs> I wish you both a fun-filled time on Narukami Island. There was definitely something strange about the way she looked at me in the end there. Could she be plotting something? Sorry that you had to see that. The real reason I'm here at Yai Publishing House is to buy some books for Her Excellency. Since Watatsumi Island signed a peace treaty with the Shogunate, we've had much closer contact than we did before. I also wanted to come and see what things are like in an area ruled by the Shogunate. I hadn't counted on running into her. <sighs> I've interacted with her a few times before, but I can't say I've ever gotten used to it. I've never been good at dealing with people like her. The way she towers over me and speaks so cryptically. Something about her is strangely intimidating. I could probably deal with her in battle, but I don't know where to start when I run into her in normal life. I guess this is a weakness of mine. Really? That would be great! To be honest, this is something that's always worried me. If the soldiers ever saw me in this kind of embarrassing situation, they'd be very disappointed. So, I have to overcome it! For their sake! As soon as I've worked through this, let's go take on Yaimiko again! <sighs> first things first, though. Do you have any ideas on where to begin? Good plan. Start by studying some theory, address the fear at its root, and then I'll have nothing to be afraid of. But where would I go to learn about this? I wouldn't know anyone on Narukami Island. Oh, let's go back to Watatsumi Island and ask around there. Another bad one? No, let me try again. Any second now, we'll be face to face with her. Don't worry, all our hard work is definitely going to pay off. She can forget about teasing me this time.
Oh? You arrived a little later than expected. Did you run into some trouble along the way? Mm. But of course. That's why I'm here waiting for you. So what if you knew we were coming? This time, we won't get caught off guard. We're here to... <clears throat> <laughs> Slow down. No need to rush. Let me guess. In the past, I used to have many believers coming to see me at the shrine every day. And most of them came for the same reason. Especially those who came in pairs. Nine times out of ten, they were here seeking to know their future fate. Hoping that it would be a lifetime together. If you're interested, I'd be quite happy to do a reading for you two. T together for a lifetime? <sighs> Remember what Shuhei said? We mustn't pay too much attention to what she says. Otherwise, we may be fooled by her cunning words. Now that I think about it, perhaps I never needed to recommend that store to you in the first place. You can just leave all your fur grooming to your little friend here. Imagine her holding your tail in one hand, combing it gently with the other. Uh-oh, not good. My mind is already full of mental images. I'll have to resort to the method Miwa taught us. By the way, there's really no point in trying to hide the way you feel. You might be able to remain stony-faced if you really try, but with your tail swishing behind you, <laughs> it tells everything. What? Then again, you know what? Most people only pay attention to your tail, but those soft, pointy ears are really just as fascinating. There's only one method left. A cunning strategy that no one saw coming. This is going to hurt me almost as much as it hurts my opponent. But there's no other way! I think the real reason you know me so well is that you're just like me! Just like me, you hug your tail when you go to sleep. And just like me, you daydream about someone else grooming your tail for you! I see. You decided to admit your feelings in an effort to bring me down with you. Not bad. I suppose this is a step forward for you. But I'm afraid. I don't have a tail at all. No! Uh, uh. Retreat! Retreat! Fighting on is futile. Better to conserve resources for the next confrontation. We're out of here! When I get back, I'm going to train harder than I've ever trained before. I won't lose to her again! Bye-bye now. Come again soon. <laughs>